it opened up my eyes and I'm very cautious and worried that where are they going to strike next. Residents are on edge after learning of another small town robbery. Thanks for joining us tonight. Hitterdahl, Minnesota is looking for this man, believed to be in his mid-30s. They also have this photo of what they say is a dark getaway car. The man held a long gun and demanded money from the State Bank of Lake Park in Hitterdahl. Hitterdahl is about a 40-minute drive northeast from Fargo-Moorhead. Valley News Team's Krista Baim visited another small town in Minnesota that knows all too well the uneasy feeling. People weren't coming in and out like they do now being on the interstate. Things have changed for Marilyn Danielson, who has lived in Rothsay for nearly 50 years. It's faster paced now, and the talk of the town continues to focus on an armed robbery at their local bank three weeks ago, just a block up where Marilyn works. I had just opened up the store and I thought of locking the doors. I had no clue. We keep asking, have they found them yet? Officers are still searching for the man in these surveillance photos. And now, Rothsay has another reason to be on high alert. A second armed robbery, just 40 miles north in Hitterdahl. It makes you wonder. Yeah. Just don't feel safe. Authorities have not tied the two together, but know that small towns are far more vulnerable to crimes like these. If you have a, whether an unincorporated town that doesn't have a police department and, you were, and the response time is a lot more uh, in a rural setting, um, that's the situation that we deal with. They don't think we're equipped to handle this kind of thing. They can get by with it. Less people to see them. Which is why surveillance video is so important. An advantage in Roth say, not so much in Hitterdahl. It didn't do much good. These images are posing even more of a challenge for this town of 200. To try and find the man who authorities say had this plan. It appeared that he, he knew the, um, the layout of the bank. An aim at smaller towns. Many say they hope doesn't start a trend. We just need to take extra precautions and be more aware of our surroundings. In Rothsay, Krista Bame, Valley News Live. If you know or saw anything regarding either robbery, you're asked to please call the Clay or Wilkin County Sheriff's offices.